today we explore 2 Kings chapter 11, a chapter filled with intrigue, courage, and the restoration of a rightful leadership. When Athahiah, the mother of Ahaziah, sees her son is dead, she seeks to destroy all the royal family. But Jehoshaphat, Ahaziah's sister, bravely hides Joash, the young son of Ahaziah, and his nurse to the temple of the Lord for six years. During this time, Athahiah reigns over the land. However, Jehoshadeah, the priest, hatches a plan to overthrow her. In the seventh year, Jehoshadeah brings together the commanders, guards, and Levites, showing them the young Joash. He makes a covenant with them to protect the boy and to restore, and restore him to the throne. In a dramatic scene, they crown Joash as king. The people rejoice, clapping their hands and shouting, Long live the king! Atahiah hears the noise and rushes to the temple, and she sees a boy king standing by the pillar. She tears her robe and cries, Tears, tears, tears. Jehoiada orders the capture and to execute her. Jehoiada then leads the people to renew their covenant with the Lord, tearing down the temple of Baal and restoring the true worship in the land. Jo Joash, the boy, begins to reign under the guidance of Jehoiadan. This chapter teaches us to be courage and protect what is right, and the powerful faithful leadership and the importance of restoring to true worship.